Dennis has already ripped the top off this washing machine. It was an accident. I tipped there's, it over. There's a bolt down in the bottom of this. We're just going to cut down here and then take the bolt out. And then hopefully there's just a few bolts around the edge of this. Area. Yeah, those usually just snap off. Those bolts, yeah? Yeah, yeah. They, they don't come undone. Tried it before. Bit, bit short. That's alright. Break them off now. Yeah. Ready? the usual it started to rain mm -hmm. whenever Dennis and Jeff yeah. catch up always rains so um we've um smashed them out these are actually out but don't worry because it's um sometimes they are tight and the calcification yeah. really gets them in there and you can't yeah. get them out in so old, old washing machine old washing machine so it doesn't matter that if they're snapping out like this that means this is still good high grade stainless steel and not some cheap inferior metal so get all the crap out so that's what we got that's what we want all this i'm going to put it out on the street for the scrap metal man could injure yourself it's not that it's that these uh sit out and then it doesn't sit flat in, inside the Sort of rock, rocks on the inside when it's sitting in. Plus, this lawnmower is 100 years old. We pick this up on the side of the road. Yeah, and this range grips as it's turning, whereas uh, shifter and that just kind of. And just round spins. it. All right, that's on your side, mate. You're up. That one came off, so it's all pretty good. But this one will not budge, so we're going to have to just grind the back off. It's the easiest way. Five minutes later. <laughs> <laughs> Two hours later. But yeah, okay. that's what happens sometimes. If it doesn't go in the first time, just do it again even harder. Shouldn't have your hand up here. Should have it out of the way where it's safer. But I'll show you everything not to do. There's usually two, so just we'll just pull off like that. And you got your lead there because you don't want that melting. Right, so we've got our parts. So we've got the angle line for underneath. We got our lawnmower base. Get a bolt with the washer, so always put it that way. And if you ever want to replace the bolt and you have the nut at the top, you get water in here and ash and heat, you're never gonna get it undone. Yeah. So that's all that's all sitting together, all comes together pretty well. And some other holes lined up there. Look at that. What's the chance of that? Yeah. Never works out like that though, does it? Yeah. Alright, so then you just flip it over. Right there. Get, the, get, the bolt. Right. get it nice and tight. 
and position it. Yeah, you come over this side, you give me that one, you take this one, and you see the line up better because you do everything by the way, I don't. I'll never get the light. We can put a little wood to chop it up. You good? Yeah. Alright, we'll start the video from here, ready? Sure. So I'll, I'll do this, ready? Now. <laughs> now. Cut everything, let's go now, right? This is all bullshit. Alright. I well, made a mess, alright? Yeah. Sometimes it does tend to pull. If it's just one person, I don't want the difficulty. But there's two of us, so we wouldn't have that difficulty. What do you reckon that should be alright, eh? Yeah. I think it's straightening out the bottom of that thing. Alright, give me that. Yeah, bolts through, pulls, pulls the rim up, pulls the... Can I put it down now? Cause it's you, heavy. you can put it down now. Pulls that down, just pinches the washer between them. It's a really quick build. It's up to you. you want to use one in the center. On this one here, we use, use three. We use three straight through the stud holes. But that's it. How simple and quick sound. It's quick, you know. The rim we found on the road, that hence the dent. Yeah. You know, so it costs us nothing. And the bolt we found. Yep. So that's it. Done. Yeah, that cock correction too happy. When you twice as cold, <laughs> twice the fire always helps. Mm -hmm. Pretty simple and effective. Extremely effective. We use that one plenty. 